Hello guys and welcome to my YouTube channel. My name is Kazungu Duncan, the director and founder of Aero Productions. And today I just want to do a quick tutorial. I remember last time when I did a tutorial on how to create an animated uh, lower third in Premiere Pro and I said you can uh, still uh, import this uh, to uh, OBS for live stream for those who are live streaming online. So today I just want to show you how you can now take the complete uh, lower third and put it uh, into or import it into uh, OBS. So we shall hover on to OBS and uh, in this OBS we in the scenes we will need to add a new scene so you can just come here and say add a new scene and maybe you can call it uh, lower lower third lower third just like that and then after adding this scene we now need to add a, a source and we shall add two sources one we shall add the lower third and the second source we shall add is the video itself so that when once the video is playing now the lower third has to i mean play in the background and if you hear some noise in the background kindly understand that i am working from home and for those of you who are new to my youtube channel i would like you to subscribe to my youtube channel for uh so that i can even achieve the 1k subscribers and again for those who have already subscribed to my youtube channel i want to say thank you so much and i, I appreciate every support that you're giving to me now I want to create a new source so I'll just click here new and then I'll, I'll bring it as a media source and I, let me, I'll just now say source and then I can call it lower third there's no crime uh, repeating the same name uh, lower third and say okay uh, or oh, this one is already used, used so I can just say maybe lower third one and they say okay then I will browse for my for my lower third I'll allow it to load so I'll go, I had put it in uh, local, uh, my new volume D, uh, just give it a bit, uh, my computer is a bit slow so you will understand. Uh, let me look for my lower third, I think it should be here, yes, this one, this is the last lower third that I made in the tutorial that I had and if you did not watch this tutorial, kindly find a link in the description so that you can go and watch how to create this uh, lower third now I'll make sure that I'm, I'm checking loop so that you know I made this like about seven seconds so I want it to be looping when it is complete for the seven seconds so it repeats itself so make sure that you check loop and say okay now you can see uh, the here is the lower third and it is set to I mean to play whenever it is active and then I'll just make sure that it is fitting in this screen so I'll just come here in the corner and drag it so that it fits in the screen perfectly so that is a full HD screen then the, the next thing I want to do I want to bring the footage that I'm going to use in this uh, source so I'll just add a new source and come to media and may I call it the maybe video for example then say ok then I will browse for my video I'll browse for my video. Maybe uh, this is a video I did on my. Uh, maybe let me not not pick that. Let me pick a different one because that one has already it. Ha, it already has the lower third. So maybe I should pick something like this. By the way, this is also a workout that I did. You can still find a link in the description for those of you who want to work out. Uh, we this is a workout that I did some a uh, few few weeks ago. Uh, for the ladies and uh, I think it is it is helpful for them so you'll also make sure that it is fitting in the screen I don't know why it's hanging but I, uh, I believe it will be okay in a uh, in few minutes that is how it should be and then I'll make sure that the video is below the lower third so I'll just select the video and click here so that it goes in the background now I need now to remove this green so what I'll do, I'll just come on the lower third source, I right click and go to filters. Then in the filters, I will I will search for uh, I mean an effect, an effect uh, called uh, what do you call it, the chroma key. So I will add uh, a chroma key. Let's uh, uh, where is it chroma key? Yeah, chroma key. And uh, just give it some few. Uh, yeah, you can just call it chroma key that way. 
then it will automatically remove uh, that green and leave you with the background. And I think the defaults are working pretty good, so I don't have time to go and uh, soften it. But if you do not have a solid color, like for, for example green or blue, you have to set here and make sure that the the thing is is good. But I think the defaults are just working pretty good. I'll just say close. So you can see now here, I have my footage, I have my uh, my lower third, and, and and it's pretty good. So once I've done this, you go to your settings and maybe if you want to live stream on YouTube, if you want to live stream on uh, Facebook and all that. So this is basically how to add a lower third in uh, OBS and therefore you can go uh, live stream and, and, and make your fans be happy. And I want just to say if you haven't uh, subscribed to my YouTube channel, kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel and uh, I will appreciate that. And for the new ones who have subscribed, I want to say thank you so much. And I hope that this tutorial truly helped you and I hope to find you in uh, our next tutorial. And in case you have a, um, a request for a tutorial to be done, I would like you to just let me know in the comments below so that I can make a tutorial for you. So uh, let me hope that this has been a blessing to you. Goodbye.